I have heard so many great manners today while we were playing. I'm so very proud of each and every one of you dragons. Today we have a very special surprise. Who was surprised by this party today? Jim Justice and his his dog, Baby Dog. Something that is really special. 
not only did you win a party for your school, but Jordan, if you'll bring me that, you won $50,000 for your school. This was our do it for baby doll round three, and of all the schools in the state, there were four schools chosen, but you absolutely won our elementary school, and so you should be really proud. Clap for yourself for the Baby dog and I will present this. Here's this check. It looks like a bone, doesn't it? You got to come over on this side. And I'm going to hold it. And there you go. Congratulations. Congratulations, dog. There you go. Now, now, when we get ready, when we get ready to leave, you know, if you all want to come up and pet baby dog and say hi to baby dog, you're more than welcome to do so. We'll let your teachers bring you, bring you up so we won't everybody come at one time. But the other thing, thank y'all in every way. Thank you so much. Thank you, Superintendent. Thank all of y'all in every way for what you do. From what I know, in all ways, you know, Randall Reed Smith, who's our curator of the arts, he says that you guys, not you guys, because y'all aren't quite old enough yet, but the high school, you know, girls and boys are constantly, constantly winning in our history bowl, and on and on and on. It must be really special. Yes, ma'am. Um, I got two things to tell you. One, you got your baby dog. It looks like my brother's dog, Bentley. Okay. And two, that my brother plays the Super Bowl. And she does? Okay, that's great. That's just great. Yes. There you go. That's so good. Congratulations for me, please. Please do. Okay, well, I'll tell you what now. Our junior kids are coming back up. Yeah, me too. That's why I'm here. 
I'm proud of you guys. You guys did an awesome job. You have a great school. Okay? I'm going to turn it back over to Dr. Haynes. Okay. 